Yo, what's good guys? It's your boy Biscuit, aka Biscotti, and we are finally back with another Destruction All-Stars video for your head tops. In today's video, we are going to go over the new big update that is coming out in January. We're just going to go over all of the stuff that the devs have said in this update. There's quite a bit of information to take in, and we've got some new clips to show you about this big update as well. Make sure you like the video sub up to the channel and tap off that notification bell without further ado let's get into the good stuff all right first things first destruction all stars is going to get a whole new look and feel in game and on the menus as well so as you can see right now this is just a preview of the new interface to come we can see Muna standing there and there's a few new elements that we're just going to pick out and go over real quick looks like they seem to have added some new challenges as you can see they've got dailies and weeklies as well as that graduation cap which kind of could be um, hot shot challenges or whatever the new season challenge is going to be. The way you search for matches is now different as well. As you can see, it says final for players and there's competitive trios there as well. And also, if you didn't clock, they've got an emote sign as well. So now you can emote in the lobby, just like Fortnite. Next up, they've revamped the HUD look and feel during gameplay as well. So you can see a few new changes. The HUD has been revamped. Blue Fang has new animations when he's double jumping. This will be across the board for all characters, obviously. But here's just a small clip of what you can expect. So as you can see, the HUD has been simplified. We've got Blue Fang's abilities. We've also got the multiplier bar above as well. Next up, they've got some new visual effects when you run in to opponents so this is just to make it feel better when you crash into someone add a bit more visual effect and give you that nice look and feel next up they've made some changes to the post match screen so if you make it to the top three you're going to be put on a podium they show you all of the xp that you got beforehand what position you got in but now they've revamped it so you can see what challenges you have completed in that match and it just looks overall better it looks a little bit more you know champion status you've made it to the top three podium and is showing off the characters right here you can give accolades and see the match results from this screen as well after a match finishes as well they've also changed what happens when you back out of the queuing system so now they show you all of the things you've unlocked live on your screen again kind of um, like how Fortnite would do it they show you everything you've unlocked during that match all the shouts and as you can see we've got a new preview of the screen here as well the final other big change that they've made is to the gameplay mechanic system so as we touched on earlier with the Wreckington multiplier bar now your abilities won't just passively recharge during a match you actually have to do cool things in the match like takeovers wreckovers and skills to basically charge your bar so the better you play in the match the quicker you can fill your bar just like you can see now in this new multiplayer bar those were the main talking points from the update from the destruction all-stars dev team it's looking like we're getting a very big update in january there's going to be more things coming and i will be covering it on the channel we've also got some genesis gameplay coming up as well so here's some gameplay for you guys hope you enjoy it Live in London. Three, two, one, go! We have liftoff. It's every all-star for themselves as they create mayhem and earn points in the arena. When the clock hits zero, the all-star with the most points wins. Flawless use of the arena's hazards. Very fast, lifting your rest. Did you see that? Incredible wreck over.
Jump complete. Time's up on that hero vehicle breaker. <laughs> How much more can they take?